hello everyone welcome to my other video in this video i'm going to show you how to implement firebase push notification in your react application so let's get started so before starting uh, make sure that you have already installed node.js and npm in your system so open your terminal and write npx space create dash react dash app and your app name in this case i'm giving my app name as firebase dash uh, cloud dash messaging and press enter and it will take some time to install all the dependencies after that you have to write your app name uh, cd space uh, your app name to enter uh, inside your app directory so write cd space firebase dash cloud dash messaging and then write code space dot to open uh, text editor into the same directory so i'm using vs code here now open your terminal uh, inside VS Code and you can also use the default terminal and write npm space install space firebase to install the firebase dependencies in your project. So after completing you have to go inside ssc directory and inside ssc directory you have to create one file that is firebase.js. So here I am going to put all the configuration of firebase. So inside uh, firebase.js, you have to first import that dependency of firebase. So write import firebase from firebase. And then uh, write const and create one object uh, for configuration. So write const config equals to. And here uh, I need to paste all the configuration keys values. Okay. So open your browser and uh, go to firebase.google.com and go to console and make sure that you have already uh, signed in inside the firebase. So here uh, you have to add one more project and here I have to give the project name. So I'm giving the project name as firebase-cloud-messaging then click on this blue button and turn off this uh, analytics part because you don't need that and then click on that button again all right now click on that button and uh, this type of window will be opened and as you are going to implement in your website click on web icon and here again you need to give your application name that is firebase dash cloud dash messaging so write that and click on this button and after clicking on this button one configuration file will be generated or you can say one script will be generated uh, inside your script you can see all the api key messaging uh, sender id and all and you have to copy this thing and just go inside your code again and paste it here okay now uh, what you have to do uh, you have to initialize that config so write firebase.initialize app and pass that config object and finally export it as default so write export default and uh, have to export as firebase so write export default firebase now save it and go inside app.js file and at first delete the whole thing because I'm going to implement as a classful component so uh, I'm using one shortcut here for VS code so now write constructor and take props here and call the super pass the props and then uh, write this dot state and keep it as empty and I don't know if I need to use it or not and then uh, here you need to write component it mount okay uh, well I need to first import firebase uh, inside this app.js file so write import firebase from uh, dot slash firebase because it is inside the same directory the firebase file now write const messaging and assign 
फैडविस डॉट मैसेजिंग एंड देन राइट मैसेजिंग डॉट रिक्वेस्ट परमिशन एंड इट विल रिटर्न वन प्रॉमिस सो राइट डॉट टेन एंड देन वन कॉल बैक फंक्शन एंड इट विल पॉपुलेट द टोकन आई गेस so right return messaging dot get token and then uh, right dot then and then again one call back function so i think uh, i can get the token here so right token okay so here uh, i'm just uh, i will just show you inside the console so uh, write console.log and first just write token and then just pin that token okay now save it now handle also the error so write dot catch for that so write dot catch and again it will take one callback function and just lock uh, something error like error okay now save it and uh, again go to your public directory and here you need to create one file so inside your public directory uh, you have to create one file named firebase dash messaging dash sw dot js and uh, here this file will work as a service worker so you have to uh, first write these two lines and you can surely copy it from my project and i will give the link of this project inside my description section you can check it out so after that uh, you have to write firebase dot initialize app and go to your firebase.js file and just copy the sender id key and paste it here okay so now uh, write const uh, init messaging equals to firebase dot messaging okay now save it and open your terminal again inside vs code and write npm space start to start the react server so uh, click on this this button and if you go to the localhost 3000 port uh, you can't see anything because i haven't rendered it uh, but you, if you want to render anything you can so if you go inside your console you can see that is uh, one token token is there so you have to just copy it and go back to your firebase console and if you scroll down you will get one option that is cloud messaging and click on send your first message and here you need to feel like uh, test or whatever it is you need to write here so just click on this button and it will ask for that particular token so paste that and click on this plus icon and finally click on send and here you can see that one push notification is there so that's it for today hope you have enjoyed this video please click on the subscribe and like button if you like this video thank you